What is up guys and girls, it's Ghost Robo and we are here with Hearthstone, the curse of Nex Ramus Adventure. I think this game is downright brilliant. I'm a big fan of card games, I've always loved Hearthstone and I was looking for a way to bring it to my channel and this new expansion that was just released is that way. So we're gonna check it out for a little bit. This isn't like a full series or anything like that. I just wanted to play something I really enjoy with you guys and I'm eager to check out this new set of cards here in Blizzard's card game video game awesome cornucopia of love sweat blood tears and joy so we're gonna jump right in this is the first uh first part of this big expansion it's a multi wave multi quartered multi dlc thing and the first one is the arachnid corner so we're gonna touch the skull key open this up and see what happens i have never played this expansion i don't know what we're gonna face off against but it looks like We've got three bosses to beat before we get to a treasure chest. And I love that the, they mix simplicity and complexity perfectly here. The speed of everything is beautiful. Is one of my finest spider lords. Oh my. Good luck, interloper. <laughs> interloper. Goodness gracious, I don't think I've ever been addressed as interloper, but we got a giant spider. I'm afraid of spiders, so this is perfect. We are gonna battle him uh, and see what we can do. Um. What deck do I want to go with? I guess we'll go with Jaina here and see what we can do against the Spider Master. Come on, now boil that ooze. Rub it all over the, the spider, not me, please. Spraying stench again. Do it to the spider, not me. I'm playing this on my iPad. Jaina versus Anubrakan. Anubrakan. Is this a new Welcome arena? Welcome to my parlor. Hello. You asked for it. All right, beautiful. Um, so we're gonna swap out this one and this one. I'll keep the Murloc Raider. My favorite part of Hearthstone is the arena, where you get to kind of draft your own deck and then go and see how well you can do. What is his power? Skitter. Can I see it? Summon a three-one Nerubian. First of all, I don't know what a Nerubian is. Second of all, three-one seems pretty good. We'll throw our Murloc Raider in here and see if our tactical prowess can't bring us victory. Ooh. Death Charge. I'm excited to see what these new cards are because I played uh, a bunch of the base set. I played it when it was in beta like for ages. Me and Noah would just be obsessively playing um, and I haven't played it in a little while so I'm excited to see what these new cards are kind of like here. Um, let's throw this guy into the battlefield. Bring out a crocodilo to take on this zombie horse. Alright, Haunted Creeper. Going straight for Jaina's throat. I like that, Spider-Man. Spider-Man. You do not deserve the name Spider-Man, that's for certain. Other minions get plus one attack. Draw a card. Um, let's... Oh. I only have three. So next turn, we'll make our our serious move. Um, he gets plus three attack, and we'll take him straight at Anubrakan. I'm guessing if you uh, are a big WoW Blizzard player in general, uh, a lot of these guys hold a special place in your heart. Maybe you battle them or something of that nature. Me, on the other hand, I just think they look cool. Who is this 2-8? Taunt, death rattle, your opponent puts a minion from their deck. Okay, so when he dies, it's a pretty sweet card, but when he dies, I get a free minion, so maybe it's not so sweet. Um, eight is a lot of health. I could just transform him, but I kind of want to kill him. Just four is going to be a lot, so I think we better do this. Just get him out of there. Not even waste time with it, um, and then we'll attack directly. Let his little spider squad sit there and do their dirty work. Okay, here comes the Nerubians. He's a basic character, I'm guessing. Love my new recipe. Ooh, great. Lower my attack, swap it out, just like that. And your sheep tried to rub his fleece all over me, but it felt good. It didn't hurt. My health clearly is still in good A-OK -okay shape. Um, we gotta start... I, I gotta start clearing some of these guys out here. This is getting ugly. So we'll take that guy out first. Um, we'll remove the sheepy sheep. Get out of here, sheep lord. And I guess our only play right now is to bring in a novice engineer. Ooh, arcane missiles. Perfect. Exactly what I needed. What a brilliant play. Yes. Eliminate the battlefield and we are back in the advantage. I love turning the tide of battle. And what I love here is that the games go so quickly, you can play one, I don't know, about five to ten minutes, and it's not a big commitment. This is like the best, you know, late night game, the best in between game. It's just, it's, it's really, really good. Um, 
So we have to attack him, and when he dies, everyone's gonna go down with him. So I guess we could just get rid of him right off the bat, rather than waste time. Let's do that, or oh, or I could just do six damage right to his his dude, Anubricon, directly. Um, bring out the the ogre. Yeah, let's take this strategy. This will be an interesting one. I'm not sure exactly if it'll work or not. I have to attack him. There's kind of no point in doing that. It's just sacrificial, so... I'm gonna end my turn and see what kind of monster madness... Oh, you great. Two abominations. Oh, God. All right. This is gonna take out my crocodilo and try and bring in his mad guys for massive damage, and he takes the lead. This is not looking good, Jaina. I know spiders are scary, but we have to do the best we can to keep things from getting too hairy. Alright, so I guess... We'll do this here. She's gonna do two damage to everything. At least it clears the field a little bit. Um... I wish I had someone with taunt, but I just don't right now. You know what, let's put the pain on him. I guess. And then I'm gonna bring in my uh, my Bloodfin Raptor and see if a Dino and an Ogre can find a way to work together. Oh God! Wow! He wipes the field and takes my God. This guy means business. Holy craparella! Okay. Um. I really need to draw a card, so let's do that first. Let's get this guy out here. Pick up a card. Ah, it's just a Bloodfin Raptor. Okay, so this is probably gonna- I should have done this differently, but oh well, this is probably gonna be the best way to do it. One damage, boom, it's gonna do two to everybody, and then I'm gonna bring out my poor little baby, Jurassic Parkian, and see if he can't save the day. Minions with Battlecry cost two more. Oh god, he's gonna freeze my blood fin and kill it. Great! Alright, the spider- <laughs> The spider onslaught is severe in this one. I am in- very big trouble. I hope I get a good pull, and I did not at all. Crap. Okay, so we'll kill this guy. Um, we'll bring in the Murloc Raider. And I guess... I guess we'll just use our mana to Sheepify. Okay. Not ideal, but we're pulling along, and I don't know if it's just the way they balance the game or what, but I, I, I really kind of get a kick out of the fact that most of these battles end up going till the very last second. Which is pretty cool. I am... I'm in serious trouble. <laughs> this is a good deck. A Nubricon. You are bringing the heat here. This is not looking pretty. My poles are not beautiful. This is just a basic deck too, which is... Yeah, I am... I am pretty much toast here. If I can't get it, something magical to happen in the next turn, I am just about done for. Oh god, a 5-5 spider really now? Wait. Yeah, he is gonna put the pain drain on me. Four damage to my small man. And yeah, he's going straight for the kill. Oh god. I need the luckiest draw ever right here. And I got a taunt. Okay. This is not gonna put me in the best shape, but it's it's Oh god. I think he's still gonna be able to finish me off unless I'm careful. Okay. So we gotta take that guy out. And then we gotta take this guy out. Okay, but it spawns two more. Yeah, I'm- that was the wrong play. No! Anubricon, you're gonna get me. You're gonna get me. This is not pretty. Yeah, he's gonna finish the fight right here. Dang! This spider lord is severely psycho. Do not approve. He means business. He means serious business. Do I get any of your cards? Do I get anything from you? No? You kidding me? All right, let's go back at him once more. So this uh, this expansion here is not pulling any punches. I cannot switch off of a basic deck at all. Um, who should we use this time to kind of counter his craziness? Maybe I want to go with... A, I kind of like the way the Warlock works. Right? Draw a card, take two damage. That's pretty good. Or do I want to go Druid, where you can armor up and attack? Hmm. He's got a lot of cards that deal damage. So maybe something would, maybe like a quick kill would be better. Ah, who should I use? Where should I go? 
The hunter with two damage, the enemy hero. We might be able to just finish him off fast. Mm. I'm not sure. I, I, let's go with the, the warlock. Let's see if the warlock can play some games. A little bit of evil against his evil, you know what I'm saying? That might be a good idea. Round two. Can we do it? Do you think we can? Sometimes I hate losing, but sometimes it's, it's good. Because it like... If, if you don't lose, it doesn't make the Welcome to the victory as exciting. And here, Your soul shall be now it's going to be a little juicier once we snap all this guy's legs. We're getting rid of that. I'll keep those two one minions in to try and get an early advantage. War Golem does not really help me. It would be cool if you could bring in your own custom deck here. But it would probably be way, way, way too tricky to balance. So um, I can understand why they do it this way and why they have you use the pre-constructed decks. But... What would be really awesome is if you unlocked a new character. Like, if I could be a new Brickton uh, after this, that would be pretty awesome. Um, discard a random card kind of stinks, but then I'm, I'm going to establish pure supremacy. All right, that's not a bad loss there. All right, let's, let's see if we can take him early and move on to the next spider. That 3-1, like, I feel like that's a little bit of a, of a super sexy ability right there because he gets a... A dear advantage. Um, hmm. All right, I guess we'll sacrifice here. Go there. Take two damage to draw a card. We've got an early lead, so why not? And we get, ooh, a Void Walker with Taunt. Perfect, that was a great grab. Good work, Warlock Master. All right, here's that guy. It's a 2-8, but lets us put a big free minion into play. Um. Man, I don't like that he's a 2-8. Should we tap and draw? Because, see, we have to go straight at him. As the master Let's tap and draw once more. I, I don't like burning my health, but that's a good pull for next turn. We'll get another guy in here. Um, and we can actually... Uh, as you we might as well, as right? Might as well lower him down. Done. Gotta get that 8 out of there. Okay, that's cool. Ooh, that guy goes back to full health. Is that every turn? The start of your turn, restore this many. Wow, he's an impressive hooligan there. Um, all right, let's do this. This will bring my succubus back and bring my warlord lock back to prettiness. Um, all right, we'll take the damage on the crocodile. Brings in a minion. Yes, another succubus. Okay, does it have summoning sickness? It does. All right. Um, yeah, let's kill this guy. See, look, now we got total battlefield supremacy, so unless we screw this one up, I think we got him right where we want him. We had some really good early draws, and I think we are going to make this spider sad for spraying his silk straight at our face. Okay, he's bringing in a haunted creeper who we don't want to take down. Remember that, he splits, so it's not a good idea to go for the throat on that guy. Um, okay... Restore two health to, I guess, the succubus. It's only one health, but it's it's okay. I mean, I think I'm just going to go for a power game here. Yeah, let's do that. Um, I will take a life tap for a card. Four damage to a minion. Beautiful. All right, destroy a friendly minion. Deal to tech damage to all. And wow, okay. That was a smart play. He destroyed his own. He gets two new guys, and he damaged me pretty significantly. Um, let's see. What do we want? I could bring out the War Golem and really finish things off. Um, deal four damage to a minion. Spell damage plus one. No one has charge. I think I'm just going to get in here. I'm going to restore two to everybody. I'm going to bring in my Monkey Monkey. And then I'm gonna go straight at him. Yeah, we got him. We got him. See, look at that. Change up our strategy. Bring in the warlock. All is well. That's the shade of next Ramus. Aim plus one plus one at the start of your turn. Okay. Clear the field, but he doesn't have enough to stop me. It's over, baby. It's over. First spider sunk. Good work, everybody. I love it. I love it. I love it. Fireworks and victory flags. Nice, nice, nice. 
Okay, Haunted Creeper. Summon two one one special sp spectral spiders. All right, that guy's okay. We'll take him. Adds to our arsenal. I like that. We're getting some cards from Nexramus himself. And we open up. Ooh, it's a girl. Paolina is training acolytes to worship me. Her job is very important. Do not disturb her. Fire a missile for each card in your opponent's hand. Holy meat, that's crazy. Let's go at her. Should we bring the warlock again? I think we ride with the warlock just because we had success. And see if we, uh, see if we can't replicate what we just did. Go one more round here. Gul'dan versus Grand Widow, Fairlina! Fairlina! My acolytes serve me without question. Your soul shall be mine. I don't like that I have to go first all the time, but it looks like we're establishing another strong starting hand. Pull a succubus, please. Give me a oh, chillin' Yeni. Not what I would like to see here. She's pretty cool. I would like to be her. She's got a cool character model. Ooh. Um, we bring in the Murloc and we say, end your turn. Put the freaking Good, good, good. Nice turn there, Grand Widow. You're scaring me. Um I guess we'll bring in the taunt. Why do you call? Yeah, let's just establish minion dump. What is happening here? Oh, like, restoring two health does nothing, so it's okay. Murloc. And also, I want to keep my hand low, because I don't want her to fire those missiles. That's a such a strong power. It works against me. Those missiles could attack anywhere, which really stinks. And that's... I feel like these guys in this expansion have uh, a lot of really really tough moves. Now, the first quarter, as they're calling it, like this arachnid quarter, is free for the first month. Um, but after this, you will have to pay, I believe, for the other quarters. I think it's like $20 for everything, um, which is pretty good. And again, if you get in at the beginning, you get to play the first one for free. Deal one damage to a minion. Okay, I'm just gonna kill him. So it's interesting to see Blizzard, exp you know, just mess around with DLC. This is a free-to-play game, harder than they introduced DLC. Yada yada yudi. Um, might as well bring in the yeti. This might be another easy victory, depending on uh, this, depending on if they can't get anything out. I want to see more of her cards though. All right, ooh, dancing swords. All right, these, these spiders seem to do a lot of things with death rattle, where they get an advantage up front, but then we get quite the advantage, you know, afterwards. Um, all right, let's bring in another. I guess. No, let's bring in an ogre magi. Um. Kill that, we get to draw a card, but drawing cards is kind of not in our favor um, in this this round here. But I don't see how she's gonna recover. She's already down 11. Alright, those are some good missile strikes. Another dancing set of swords. Reminds me of the uh, cleaver from Donkey Kong Country 2, Diddy's Kong Quest. Diddy Kong's Quest, okay. Heal everybody up. Brilliant. Um, and I'm just gonna go directly at her. Because, yeah, she's right at seven. Come on. Three damage to all characters. Holy crap. Well, you're done. Unless you unless you get lucky with these missile strikes. No, you're still dead. You're still dead. That was the simplest of simples. Boom. Burst your bubble, Feralina. The master will avenge you. I don't think so. This warlock is doing work. Slight work. Ooh, what did we get? The Spider Queen will dispatch you easily. Minions of Battlecry cost two more, but it's a 1-4. That's pretty cool. I mean, I get rewards for my Warlock, but that doesn't really matter. I've played through this so many times. Not this, but like the unlocking of the main characters or whatever. Um, because I've done... I played it on PC, on Mac here, and I've, I guess, restarted. And the, be oh, the beta also was the big issue that I restarted with the beta. Um, but uh, the next one up is... Quiet. He's a giant spider! <laughs> My Exna the giant spider with her three mana power that returns a random enemy minion to your- That's pretty darn good. I mean, it could be bad if I'm the warlock where I have low level minions and then I just put them right back out there. But hey, this is a pretty cool little thing they're doing. I like this adventure mode here. And you can see there's these four other quarters that open week two, open week three, open week four, open week five. Um, and if we go back just for a split second, uh, you can see how this works, I think. Well, there's also class challenges. If you complete a wing, um, then class challenges, and then there's also heroic mode, which is ready for round two, a very difficult. So there's basically like, almost like New Game Plus 
Um, and if we back out entirely and go to the shop, you'll see that we can purchase the full adventure four wings from 1999. It says, continue your adventure, unlock the last four wings, and earn up to 24 new cards that can be found only in XRMS. Each one will be released separately, one per week, which is sweet. So you get all those way wing things, whatever they're called, sectors, I don't know, per week. Um, I think it's pretty cool. If you guys want to see the rest of the Arachnid Quarter, if you want me to go in against, uh, what is this crazy spider queen's name? Um, Myxna? Yeah. And the rest of the, uh, the final boss of the Arachnid Quarter. Let me know in the comments below. Hit that like button if you enjoyed. Just want to share something that I've been enjoying and doesn't typically get a spot on my channel. So, hope you like this change of pace. Fantastic day. Drink some hot chocolate. Until next time, everybody. We'll see you all later.